Hey guys, it's Shaz and I'm back and in this video I'm just gonna quickly show you guys how to complete the Lana quest to get this dress. This is the reward and you also get some cash. I think you get like 1500 I might be wrong because I had like 1800 before so you do get some cash with this. Now the first part of the quest is to come up here and look at this book. It's gonna say find me user ID and then this is the user ID that you're gonna type in to the search bar on Roblox. And when you type that user ID you will get this user that's Lana Does Nails and what you will need to do next is click the serene atmosphere this um, little experience that they have here and you're just gonna load into this okay guys so i'm in the experience and this is what you're gonna need to do you're gonna need to just follow this path and it's gonna take you to a little door so i'm gonna do that really quickly also guys you need to be careful because there is like lana slashers here that can kill you and reset all your progress so be careful of that and I know it's kind of dark, just keep walking forward, you'll eventually make it to the end of the pathway. There's also some cool Lana Easter eggs in here that just tells you a little bit about what happened to Lana and that she's okay now, but she'll forever be scarred. So here is where you can see the Lana slashers. This is where you need to be careful the most. And this is the door to the maze. So how the maze works is you need four people and they all need to stand on this platform here and the platform at the bottom will glow and you will be teleported to the next phase which is happening right now so now we're loading into the maze and the maze is pretty tricky if you guys are good at understanding mazes this literally tells you the route of the maze but you can also just follow the lana paintings and so that's what we're gonna do really quickly this took me a few attempts the first time just because the lana slashers do show up and they do interfere with you a lot you can hear her screaming there so i'd recommend just to uh, you know keep walking and if you see them try spamming your space bar and jumping away from them but also remember to follow the pictures there's some over there and they they spawn pretty randomly i don't see them as much near the end of the maze though so thankfully shouldn't be bothering you as much there so i'm just i'm just following the lana pictures there's a lana slasher there so what you're gonna do is just jump jump so they don't bother you too much while you're looking and if you guys die you do get sent to the beginning again and you'll have to start over so be careful about that i have four of them like they killed me it's four of them but it's pretty straightforward the pictures do lead you to the end of the maze where you can unlock the dress and the server got shut down the team is actively making announcements here just to put like a little easter egg in the game so that shutdown was on purpose it seems i guess they're having a lot of fun with this quest it does seem so interesting really okay so we're all gonna just do this maze now Okay, and it should just be like right around here, the end of the maze. Once you start seeing those glitchy looking walls, you know you've made it to the end of the maze. 
you just gotta keep going so right here when you see this stairway you've officially made it to the end so when you get to the end of the maze here it's just gonna be lying on a little book and a little warning message and you will get a badge that says you have completed the maze now what you're gonna do is click that door and you're gonna see this final cutscene here And I'm pretty sure this is something in binary, but I don't have the patience to translate this right now. So if anyone knows what this means, please let me know because I have no idea what this means. But I know it's in binary. And then here we get teleported back into BTI. You would have gotten your cash bonus. I didn't see how much you got. This is where you get your cash bonus and then this dress should be available for you to wear. So that is how you complete the quest. This is a pretty quick video for those of you confused because it was confusing at first. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't be afraid to give a thumbs up, comment and subscribe. And don't be afraid to turn my notifications on so you know the next time that I post. But until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.